Well, good morning, guys. Um, on an earlier video that I posted, it was the one entitled A Very Productive Afternoon. And in that one, I, uh, it was just a day where we got a lot of projects done. And one of those included running over to Jerry Heath's new facility and pick up a load of mulch for my daughter. Well, I didn't want to include uh, the visit there. While I was there, I kind of took a tour around and I didn't want to add that to the video that I was working on because it would have just made it too long. So I thought you guys might get a kick and um, enjoy seeing. Uh, I went ahead while I was there and I did a nice tour around the facility and show all the things uh, that he has got going. He has been there about a year now and has just made a beautiful facility and it's just lots of really cool supplies. So. Um, Anyway, I wanted to just make a separate video just about that. So anyway, guys, again, if you are up in the Chatham, Virginia area in a little place called Tight Squeeze or anywhere around that, uh, around that area, uh, it's a great place to go pick up mulch, rock. Uh, man, he's just got so many things. I'll show you in what you're getting ready to see now. So guys, check it out, and I hope you enjoy. So guys, I thought I'd do a quick walk around and just show y'all what all Jerry has. Again, he's located here over at Tight Squeeze. Uh, Jerry Heath, a uh, longtime friend, and he just opened this up. I just asked if they've been here a little over a year now. So they've got all the pine barks and treated decking lumber. I didn't know he had that. And then he has the bales of straw and pine needles. Now I've used these before. These are what's called the long hair and the pine needles are extremely long and boy they make a pretty, in fact I'll be, there's a project I'll have coming up. There's an area that I keep up in pine needles and I'll be running back up here to get some from him. He's the only one around that I know has the long hair ones. And so anyway, they have that. And then I didn't realize he was going to be adding the flowers and all. So he's got all of that up here. And man, they did a beautiful job landscaping around their place. Y'all have a great one. We'll see you next time. Now, with you guys have seen in my other channels with my landscaping, I do a mixture of the mulch and river rock, and this is where it comes from. So this is the four to six inch rock, and this is what you see at my house, uh, the smaller and bigger boulders. And I use big straight ones like this to do my edging with, and then fill in with all the odd shapes. I'm probably gonna come back at my house and do a smaller, get the smaller rock, and kind of fill in with the cracks and crevices and then here shortly i hope to do a project around the pool and i'm going to add more river rock. i don't have any river rock back there and i'm going to add that and i probably am going to get part of a load of some of the bigger as well and then he has the dark brown double ground which is what i love to use he has the black the real light tan, and then all different kinds of rocks and sand. So I need to get pulled up and get out of this guy's way. So let me get in a hurry here real quick. Well, man, wasn't that a uh, great tour? I uh, My first time over there, but obviously will not be my last. Uh, I think Jerry did a great job putting that together, and I hope you enjoyed uh, the tour of his facility. Anyway, for me today, uh, since we did all that work, uh, we've had two long, cold, windy days of rain. So everything, which has been great because we needed it, everything was really dry, but everything's in a condition now. It's way too wet to work. So on a day like today, I'm just out of the weather and just doing some much needed repairs. So uh, for me, that's what I'll finish up this afternoon with is just doing some stuff here on the, working on the trailer. And uh, you guys remember here at Project Next, it's all about doing projects one at a time, knocking them out, 
and uh, you know there's always one more because there's just always more projects coming so guys thanks so much for tuning in I hope you guys will consider hitting the subscribe like and share with your friends and for now we're gonna call it a day you guys have a great upcoming week and stay safe and we'll talk to you soon thanks so much for tuning in and thanks for watching see you guys real soon Thank you.